perhaps you are, you're just about to run out the door, but, and you know, you're busy out there. So you wish you could maybe have one more hour to get everything done in your life. How many times have we said that during our day? Well, helping us find that extra hour is local business strategist and consultant, Kathy Hanson. Kathy, nice to have you here. Great to be here. So why are you so sure that you've come up with a way where we can eke out one more hour? How, how do we do that? I mean, it's such a big thing for a lot of us who are, we're, we're so busy, we're running kids here and there, we've got jobs, right. you name it, we're trying to cook dinner the whole bit. Right, right. well, that's a two-part question, I love it. Um, uh, as a business strategist, I deal with clients who are entrepreneurs and busy professionals mm -hmm. all the time. And then I do corporate audiences. And the one thing they say is, I don't have time to do that. I don't have time. I'm too busy. So I thought to myself, how can we make it so that in the privacy of our own home, we're figuring out what we're over or underestimating what we're doing during the day? I'm not going to be able to be there to help my clients figure out what, what they're doing. Mm -hmm. And it's never that anybody's wasting time. It's always that they're over or underestimating what they're doing. So I came up with, I designed a time diary, there it is. Mm -hmm. which I like to call the diary of truth because people are freaked out by it. Um, it's just like a food journal. It's, it's, but it's scary. It as, is, as Tom pointed out, there are a lot of lines I, in I this. It's a little daunting for me when I look at it and I see like about 30 okay, lines. Okay, well you only have to do it, here's the, here's the great part about it. You only have to do it one or two days of your week. Mm -hmm. And then the aha moment comes to you. Because I'm telling you, if you, we all, a lot of people take their devices to bed and then they wake up with them. Yeah. So look, that's, he's, he's like going gone. I'm telling it you, it's, 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 it, people <laughs> have, have come into my business series and have written blogs and testimonials about how this has changed their life. I know that sounds dramatic, okay. but it, you see it for yourself. Okay, so where are you finding that people, after they fill the sheet right. out, where are great. they wasting the most great. time? Great, great. Okay, well, I don't like to say the word waste because it feels judgmental and we're always... You know, we're supposed to be doing You're meals. not maximizing your time. How about that? Yeah, or optimizing. Yeah, whatever. And I, did, I, don't, I don't want to get over semantics. I just want people to not feel judged. Mm -hmm. I had some corporate executive man said, what if I do this and I feel really judged about how I'm spending my time? Mm -hmm. Don't feel judged about it. It's, you are going to see something that's going to be an aha moment. I have simple buckets at the bottom. So if you're not getting enough sleep, but you, we all have 24 hours in our day, you're going to see, oh, I binge watched Game of Thrones or House of Cards. Right. Mm -hmm. Maybe didn't need to do that. Or when I wake up, I spend an hour and a half answering emails before I do this. Mm -hmm. It's really a diary of truth, like a food journal. If your pants are tight, you say it's the candy corn or the margaritas or whatever. Right. So what I like to do is two philosophies. Is you look at this, then you say... Um, the comedian Jim Gaffigan used to say, when people used to bald, baldly ask him if, why he was chubby, he used to say, it's really hard to find the time to work out when you really don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> There's that. Okay. There's that. Yeah. But I reverse it, and I say, the things that are on here are what you really want to do. Is it kid time? Is it right. work time? Is it checking email, social media? There's all these things we choose to do, right? Mm -hmm. So when you look at this by yourself, and I'm not looking over your shoulder, mm -hmm you will find the biggest, to answer your question, they say that they're interrupted a lot, that they don't ever get a task done. Gosh, if I could have just gotten that task done, I'm so interrupted all the time. They say, to, that they say um, I find that I have, I do a lot of tasks intermittently all the time, or I'm multitasking 40 mm -hmm. million times. Maybe if I compact that and I have a whole video series and class and stuff that I teach on how to chunk out time and be more effective. But the time diary, it's your own private little truth diary. Where you spend your time uh -huh. is where you want to spend your time. So you just have to say to yourself, if I want more sleep, I'm going to have to take it from Tuesday, over here. Tuesday at well, 4 o'clock when I'm binge watching Game of Thrones, that's where I got to yeah. maybe, and you, maybe just watch one show. Well, right. And right. once you write it down on this sheet, you see it. And then because for a lot of us, you think about it as one thing. But once you see it, right. you know, oh. I had a, I had a wonderful architect. Um, say to me, it was almost like you were standing over my shoulder and I knew when I was doing research for projects that Kathy was gonna go. And I, and I said, but you know I'm not judging you. You know I, I, I want, no, the, the world is too full of judgments. Mm -hmm. But he said, but when I was doing research, what is research? You know, if what I'm trying to do is get you an hour a day, seven hours a week, that, that can turn into a monumental amount of time. So you just look at this like a food journal. No one looks at it but yourself. And you say, where am I spending my time and how could I get some efficiencies? Or if I'm constantly getting interrupted, I have ways to have you not be interrupted all the time. Or some people find a lawyer does this a lot and 
I know it's very tiny lines, but you're only doing it one or two days right. mm -hmm. because you want to get a really accurate picture. Because when you know more about what you actually do and you're not lying to yourself, mm -hmm. you can make better choices about how you're spending your time. And if you want to spend time, um, I, I have clients who say, I just did this one day and said, okay, for three hours I'm going to turn off all my devices because I'm feeling really bad as a mom. So for three hours she turned off all of her devices and she got grocery shopping, healthy snacks, made a meal, played games with her kids. Actually communicated. And Yeah, actually mm -hmm. communicated. Right. And she said prior to that, she hadn't told anybody, but she felt awful in every area of her life. But this was able to say, okay, I'm just going to try it one day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it makes such a big difference. To, instead of going busy, 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 we all are busy. So this works because you have to tell yourself the truth. And then you say, where do I over or underestimate? And then you mm -hmm. look at the Jim Gaffigan thing and say, I really don't want to work out. So I'm somehow man magically not ever finding that time. But the big thing is sleep. A lot of people say, I don't get enough sleep. Have we ever heard that on the show? Not on the show. Never. Yeah, so, so the thing is, is yeah. I, I say really straightforward, you have to take this tiny lines, mm -hmm. is you have to take this to bed and has to be, the day you decide to do it, you have to be honest. Am I picking up my device? I'm mm -hmm. turning off my alarm and I'm picking up my device? Life isn't in 15 minute increments. Yep. And you're not doing specifics. You're just oh, broadly yeah. right. saying, and then there's buckets at the bottom and you say, Wow, I had 24 hours in the day. Boom, work, play, sleep. Mm -hmm. and, All right. And before you know it, you before find you, some time. Before you know it, you I find like some it. time. Thank Ke you, Kelly. Great. Kelly, thanks so much. You're welcome. Great info. Kelly yeah. Hansen. Kathy Hansen. Ka it and says it's, Kelly. Why does it say Kelly? I don't know. <laughs> but it's Kathy Hansen. And my um, <laughs> website, you can ask me any questions. And I do two minute videos on my website and Facebook page. And you can get this time diary for free on my website. So okay. it's a PDF. So thank I'd you so much, it. Kathy. Well, thank you. you. Yeah. Great to be here. That. All right. And for more information on Kathy's website, just uh, go uh, backpocket.biz. Yep.